And four weeks ago, Israel was celebrating a return to normal life in its battle with COVID-19 after a rapid vaccination drive that had driven down coronavirus infections and death. Israelis had stopped wearing face masks and abandoned all social distancing rules. The main indicator guiding the move is the number of severe COVID-19 cases in hospital, currently around 45. And implementing will entail monitoring infections, encouraging vaccinations, rapid testing and information campaigns about face masks. The strategy has drawn in comparisons with the British government's plans to reopen England's economy from lockdown through Israel, though Israel is in the process of reinstating some cops while London is lifting restrictions. There's no doubt that we see the, we have a clear evidence of the efficacy of the vaccination. The patients are in very minute numbers relative to the exposure. And the patients, as I said earlier, are, have a benign course. I'm, I'm certain that without vaccination, we would have been facing a much, much worse uh, state that would impose another curfew and uh, many more uh, cases of uh, mortality. We are worriedly watching the numbers continuing to ascend despite our efforts with over 500 cases per day. And we hope that the addition of the indoor masks and the additional restrictions that we have added will allow us to curb this uh, ascent, to stop the dissemination and would not bring us to a point in which we have to make uh, tough decisions. But we will be able to take them in a few weeks from now when more data has been accumulated and we are more able to deduce the exact protection conferred by the vaccine in preventing mild disease as well as severe cases. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.